Students and professors at the South Dakota School of Mines are studying a drug-free treatment, hoping to improve the quality of life for cancer patients. Kendall Land Sydney Thorson brings you to the lab where that project is underway. School of Mines students Nicole Miller and Jordan Hobbs are working together in hopes of discovering a drug-free cancer treatment. Everybody knows someone who's had cancer, and we know the impacts that chemo has. And so, if we, you know, eventually get this where it it works and it goes really well, then it would just be amazing for us. It is a targeted technique with two important things, cold plasma and electroporation. They will shoot the cold plasma directly at the cancer cells through pores on the skin. A lot of therapies, it, it kind of is a systemic approach, so you're taking mess and it's affecting the whole body. Um, this way, uh, what we're proposing and what we're looking at is more of a targeted approach so we can affect the cancer without having uh, some of those um, the side effects that are associated with cancer therapy. Assistant Professor Timothy Brenza says lung cancer has not seen as many improvements as other forms of the disease. That's why students are using lung cancer cells. My research is on um, pulmonary drug delivery. So I have a couple different human lung cell lines that I work with. Um, so with these treatments, they were looking for cell lines to kind of um, use these treatments on. So I we just pulled my cells into it and, <laughs> and started working with them. This process is a collaboration between science and mechanical engineering. I think it's a really great opportunity for us both because I think at most schools you don't even get the chance to do the research that we're doing, um, let alone work with cancer cells. In Rapid City, Sydney Thorson, Kelloland News.